We recommend using the calibration gas kit sold by DinoJet to test the integrity of your Dino's O2 sensors. You will need to add a piece of 3 8 rubber hose to the top of the regulator. Place the O2 sensor in the top of the 3 8 hose, leaving a small gap on one side so any trapped oxygen can escape. Pushing up on the regulator opens the valve allowing the gas to flow. Your air fuel gauge and wind pep should be set to a gasoline stoichiometric. As soon as you open the regulator, the air fuel gauge on your WinPEP software should drop rapidly to near 13.0. If the gauge moves sluggishly or hesitates at a higher number, then slowly drops, replace your sensor. When running a bike on the dyno, we pass through the cells we are sampling very quickly. This requires a quick-acting sensor. It's important to remove the regulator from the gas bottle after testing for storage. That will prevent any gas from leaking out until the next use.